I agree with the NFL's decision to suspend Bontez Burfik for the remainder of the season. This guy is being way too reckless on the field. He definitely should be done playing for this season. Now, I'm not saying he should never play again. I'm just saying he should be suspended for this season. I'm glad that the NFL is doing this, and I hope Vontez Burfick learns from this. He is being way too reckless on the field. That hit on Jack Doyle from the Colts was uncalled for. He didn't have to hit him like that. Luckily, Doyle was able to get up, but it could have been worse. He could have really injured Jack Doyle from the Colts. So I'm glad that the NFL suspended him. I'm also glad that he was ejected from that game. Because sometimes these refs don't eject these players, but the refs did the right thing by ejecting him. And then the NFL did the right thing by suspending him for the remainder of the season. Now, Perfect is appealing this suspension. We'll see what happens with that. I hope he loses. And I hope that suspension is upheld. And he should be done for the season. This guy is a repeat offender. He's been suspended four times, and he still doesn't get it. It's not sinking in for some reason. For some reason, he can't understand that his reckless play on the field is jeopardizing other players on the field. For some reason, he can't comprehend that. So let him be suspended for the season. Let him sit out and think about what he's done and try to do better. He's lost millions of dollars, tons of money. That doesn't seem to stop him from being reckless. He's been suspended four, t four, uh, four times. He's been suspended four times. That doesn't seem to stop him. So yeah, let him sit out for the season. And I don't understand why Gruden and uh, Carr are upset. So John Gruden and Derek Carr are upset about Vontez Burfick being suspended. That makes no sense to me. They saw what he did to Jack Doyle. They saw it the same way the rest of us saw it. He should be suspended. He's just too dangerous. Now some people are saying he should be banned for life. Me personally, I don't want to see him banned for life. I think him being suspended for the season, that sends a strong, clear message to him. So let him sit out for the season. Like I said, I hope he loses this appeal. I really do because he's not getting it. After being suspended multiple times, after being fined multiple times, is not sinking in. For some reason, he's not understanding that his way of playing is wrong. Yes, back in the 70s and the 80s, he could play during that time. You could collide with players the way that he does. You can launch yourself into a player. So if you're a defender, you can launch into a, an offensive player. No problem back in those times. But now we're trying to be safe. He knows this. Vontez Burfick knows that the NFL is trying to be as safe as possible. And he shouldn't be hurting fellow football players. I'm all for tackling. I'm all for hard hitting. But be safe with your hard hitting. It can be done, and he knows this. It's a choice. He's just choosing to be dangerous. He's choosing to put other players' careers in jeopardy, and we just don't have time for that. So, like I said, let him sit out. Let him think about what he's done. Hopefully, by him being done for the rest of the season, that'll be a wake-up call. Maybe a light bulb will go inside of his brain, and that'll just get him to play better the following season. So that's what I believe. You should be done for the season. And that's what's probably gonna happen. And hopefully you'll learn from this and just try to do better. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. You should definitely subscribe to my channel. If you have not done so already, just press the subscribe button below this video. If you did that, I would greatly appreciate it. And plus you'll be getting more content from me in the future. So you definitely wanna subscribe. Thanks again for watching. Thanks for listening. I hope that all of you have a blessed, wonderful day.